hello guys welcome back to my channel this is mobile tech here so today i am going to show you the how to create the application like uh, bbc news and the dot times how to create the newspaper applications so i am going to show you this today so <coughs> i am using codular to make this you can use uh, thunkable and ip builder also but i am using codular to make this so and i have here two application one is admin panel for the newspaper application and another is application as it is so i will show you how the admin panel look like but uh, i have not designed well so you can design if you want but i will show you what is the function of this admin panel so here in i have used the spin so you can select the category i have world and sports only two category you can select anyone or you can create another categories also so you have to put the title like newspaper have the title so you have to put the title so you have to put the image url also you have to give the image url so after that you have to give the description or you have to give the all the news information like like newspaper as you know and after that click on input so this application is based on firebase so i am using firebase for this so you have to think or you have to understand the so you have to understand easily i think so this is the admin panel you can update the news by using this admin panel you can give more functionality to this also but i have done this much only so it uh, takes me about uh, two days to create this app so i am giving this aia also so aia will be in the video so look all the video all the procedure so in the between or anywhere uh, the aia file link will be uh, shown in the screen so i will show the application so this is the splash splash screen of the application so i have used the notification for this so this is the all the new updated news so it is showing the uh, notification so here you can see notification also so you uh, after the uh, you get new news or after you get notification this uh, red bell you can see this will be in red color so after clicking you have seen there this is notification all the notification I got and after clicking on this bell button you can see that all the notification is cleared so this is the layout and this is the uh, design of the app so I have not created the side menu but you can create I put the bottom of that uh, side menu layout so I have used the colon tree for this so you can uh, uh, see this yeah but today I am gonna tell you one thing that uh, while creating the app the app should be well designed and another is that app should be interactive user interactive app should be then only user will be uh, user will be satisfied by your app and they will download their app when there is no design and no quality or uh, no any updated the users will be will not be download will not download the app so you have to create the well designed app so i have uh, two category here you can see world and sports so uh, in the latest the top six news will be shown so in the world you can see all the uh, news will be shown here and in the sports category all the sports news will be shown so after uh, uh, so click on the uh, the on that uh, any news then you will get the news you can see here it is well designed also so you can see here time is time also when the news is updated so here you can see title how to get into football you can see the image and you can see the all the news uh, down so in the world category also you can click and see the news so i have one put the one function also that is uh, when click on news uh, you can see the news and when the you will go to the down then one floating button will be there so when you click the floating bottom but it's automatically get into the top like the in the professional apps uh, this function is also there and in many websites also so when you click the floating button it will be our go will be up so 
click on back you will go to the back and you can see the one banner right so i have one suggestion to you guys don't put the many uh, ads on the in your app because if there will be many ads the uh, user will be uh, dissatisfied or they will on directly uninstall the app if there is uh, many ads and it's uh, they hesitate to use so use one or two only ads okay so here i have put the this bookmarks bottom also but uh, but i have not done anything if you want to create then you can save the news when the users click on this uh, bookmarks bottom then the uh, news will be saved you can create that using tiny db but i have not done that and hope, hope that i will uh, update this uh, and i will put this function also and give you ai so here you can see the you can see the this all news uh, parts so let's get to get into the blocks part so let's see this block part this is admin banner so there will be add items are called a spinner i have taken two category world and sports and i have used tag uh, image url and description as a text box three and i have used one bottom for uh, inputting or storing value so i have used firebase and you can uh, take the firebase token and the url so you can see this uh, you have to create the project and after creating the project you have to create database and after creating database you will see like this and this is your firebase url you have to put in the firebase url and uh, and you can see this settings bottom click on that and go to project settings there you can see the uh, api token or api key so paste on firebase token that key okay and project bar okay to cost to null for now and here you can see when the bottom one will be clicked firebase project bucket will be the spinner selection or the or the tag uh, we have used it it as a category so then the store value the ta uh, tag will be the tag text so uh, and uh, what we are storing value we are storing value as a list so uh, we have uh, taken the make a list and in the first we have taken image url in the second uh, clock or time stamp and in the third description so we are storing this value as a list on the firebase so let's go in the actually app news real time app so okay it is loading so here in the firebase you can see there uh, while loading so i have used two category uh, sports and world you can create the another category if you want so to understand the video you can uh, if you are familiar to the list uh, you can easily understand so here i have taken the uh, for the title one card view and in there i have taken one horizontal arrangement so after that taking the horizontal and i have used the label as a menu so that menu will be uh, font typeface to the material icon and after himalaya news yeah uh, that is the main title or the app, app of the name i have set the custom font and in another we have used the notification bell icon so after that i have used the view pager for it and i have used three vertical scroll arrangements so after that uh, i have used one ermo banner and in after that the uh, one i have used one horizontal arrangement to see the loading that while news loads it will be shown so i have used uh, the colon tree and turn on a synchronized load and catch image i have used uh, a drag and drop three times so one is as the latest so i have used i have enabled the extra bottom if you want if you don't want to don't enable it I have used fab.png as the image. So I have used three times the call entry for the one is for latest news, another is for world news, and another is for sports news. So if you uh, if you 
have to put new category or another category you have to again drag and drop so these are the extensions that that i use list utils colon tree list and vertical scroll element you can drag and drop like that so i have used firebase and you can i have already shown that how to put the firebase url and firebase token you can put the project bucket now as a now and and okay this is also i have used two firebase uh, so after that uh, here you can see yeah so i have used the clock also uh, for the that and notification also notification component and sound i have used notif uh, that notification sound as a sound so let's go to the block part so here you can see when in screen initialize so admin banner load and view pager component to view and the tab name you can see there you can know you know how to put this and i use the call entry list i have say i am setting the uh, uh, arrangements on the call entry list so after that uh, i have uh, put the firebase project bucket is cost to world you can see this world category i have used this world as a category bucket as a category and with after that uh, get tag list uh, so when the tag list will be get uh, get there will be if then condition if a project bucket equals to world then th this process will be start so i have used the one variable in that variable length of the list will be stored so after that i have used the for loop or uh, for each number this loop so uh, uh loop will be go uh, go through the length of the list so uh, so when uh, what loop loop does so when it does the get value of the list uh, index number will be number so in the list uh, the index number will be number you that will it will get this uh, you can see this bold like uh, sentence it is the tag so it will get that value of that tag so these are the values so uh, it will get the all the values of that tag so after that up to length list so when the uh, firebase will got the value then the it will check the condition if project bucket equals to wall then the it will add the list into the list into the uh, global world variable i have uh, taken this uh, as the create empty list i have initialized that variable so in that i am storing the value as a list so it will select the list item from the value index 1 will be that i have said that in the admin panel index 1 will be title and uh, 2 will be the uh, time stamp so here i am getting the get tag as a 2 and uh, in the third ones i have used the image url so i have checked i am checking the condition and increasing the value also so if uh, global check 2 equals to global check then the world list will be get global world then after that global check 2 equals to 0 i have uh, done that and after that project bucket will be changed and it will be sports then it will again call the all the firebase tags so when after that getting uh else if you can see the project bucket equals to esports then the it will add the items to the global esports as uh, it is same as the first one so here yeah, you can see if global check to equals to global check uh, equals to then esports uh, will be as a list if so is uh, esports uh, colon tree will be set as the list and there is loop you can see here so this list uh, this loop is for latest it will take the three, uh, three three items from the sports and the world so i am uh, putting the add item to the list i have initialized variable as the latest you can see here sports so when uh, uh, after adding three, three items then the it will set list as the global latest so that we have uh, uh, set the all the list or all the latest news on that variable as a list so 
to understand video you have to know about the list so here you can see i have uh, forget to describe this this is uh, same as the up one this loop will be continue so after uh, finishing this loop uh, loading or the horizontal arrangement will be to the false so i will show this uh, some blocks ag again so i have disabled these blocks if you want to use then use it i have used the this element touch up so this element touch up i have disabled this because uh, uh, if element click and if element touch up i if i will set this then uh, uh, screen will be open two times so i have not used this i have disabled this block if you want to use then you can use it so after this here you can see when the notification level will be clicked then the text color equals to black and cancel all notification it will cancel all the notifications you can see this get on the uh, notification cancel all notification so after that i will describe this uh, latest click when the element will be clicked so i am looking so when the world you can see this world news when the world news uh, element will be clicked then the global uh, check element equals to 1 then uh, then the index uh, or element index will be set into the itx element global variable and call the project bracket equals to wall then the set project bracket equals to wall and it will call the procedure call called call so after that you can see this latest uh, element click when the latest element click uh, then the it will it will do the same and project bucket equals to world the process is the same so when the sports then the it will set to the project bucket is equals to sports then it will call the procedure called call so here you can see i will show you this uh, procedure also in this procedure i have used if then block if global check element equals to one you can see this when the element will be clicked then the check element will be one then uh, there is another if then condition in that condition it will check the global or the project bucket equals to world or not if project bucket equals to world it will select the list item and put into the global variable called checking list i have initialized it so it will select the item here it will select the item from the global world uh, that is index number is uh, that uh, which line is we clicked one two three or four uh, and after that then it will select the item list from the uh, item item list as the index 2 after after getting that uh, it will get all the tag list so here you can see when the firebase got value it will open the another screen but i will explain this uh, procedure well so here you can see is that else if if uh, uh, project bucket is esports then the global checking list will be uh, of the list sport it will uh, select the list item from the global sports then it will put into the global checklist so it is same as the up but uh, the list is uh, changed or global variable is changed uh, global world and global sports then again it will get uh, tag list after that if the uh, check element equals to zero then the it will uh, it will uh, select the latest news so here you can see when the when we call the tag list of the firebase db2 you can see here i am calling that firebase db when it will call the firebase db2 then the it will check the the whether the value is uh, in the list or not so we are uh, checking after this is state of the clicking clicking the latest news so if the list uh, value is in the list then it will get uh, 
uh, to the it will get value from the check English if not then the project bucket will be sports and it will get the value from the sports so after getting the value it will open the new screen and we are uh, transferring your to list item as a tag and value so here you can see when the news or when the screen is initialized floating action button will be disabled but I will show what are the extension here yes okay same extensions and I have used vertical scroll handler so here I have used one card view and another space item and vertical as many you can see here I have used two levels and let's see the block part so uh, after that async image loader you can see it will select the image from the uh, item or it will select we have uh, sent the two value it will select i we have to select the image uh, image url from the item so we are using this select list item and in the uh, time we are selecting the time uh, and it will select the item list from the two or it will get the uh, say list from the global value or when the firebase got value we have passed the that value so uh, that value is the list is like this index 1 will be the image url and index 2 will be timestamp and index 3 will be the description so i am using this like this so after that news line you can see this is index 1 so that is tag so uh, so title is uh, in, uh, selected as the index 1 so and level uh, level 1 you can see this uh, index 3 or it is called it is descriptions so i have selected the descriptions as the index 3 so here another two two states when the uh, particle scroll uh, will be reach bottom then the floating bottom will be shown uh, when the floating bottom will be clicked then it will scroll up and it will hide the floating bottom so when news uh, back press uh, it closes the screen this for today guys if you like my video subscribe my channel and like my video too if you want to share with friends you can share with your friends so this i think this video helped you so much and uh, AIA file uh, link will be yeah, on the screen you can see there and in the be between of the video there is also link so you can see this link and copy this link and uh, copy this or you in type this link in the web browser and download the AIA file and the demo apk also so i think this video helps so much if you want to create uh, or if you want to know about more things about creating apps comment down below i will make the video about that also so this uh, ai file download this ai file and uh, create your own newspaper application so thank you guys this much for today so have a peace